The following is an exclusive presentation of Cablevision local programming. TV that's close to home. Collectors guide us on a trip down memory lane. That and so much more right now on Cablevision's Neighborhood Journal. Welcome to Cablevision's Neighborhood Journal. I'm Nancy DeVasquale. On this edition, just about all of us like to collect something. For some, it's just good fun to relive old memories. But for others, searching for that special something is just as fun. No matter what the reason is, collecting's cool. So we went to a shop called Unshredded Nostalgia to find out why. People have loved collecting old stuff for just about as long as anyone can remember. Today, antique and collectible shops are popping up all over the place. From small towns to the big cities, you can now find places selling just about anything worth collecting. But some of the most sought after and interesting memorabilia is in fact made of just paper. The kind of things that were never meant to last, but have. It's called ephemera, and collectors are crazy about this stuff. Ephemera is anything that's made from a paper-based product that deteriorates with time so it becomes more rare because it doesn't hold up well, you know, through time. A lot of it is nostalgia. It rekindles a lot of memories. I got involved in the antiques and collectibles because of the paper, because of the photos and the posters, maps and original animation cells, books, magazines and sheet music, posters and lobby cards and press books. What I enjoy about it as much as collecting is researching. That's our specialty. Uh, that's our love. If we did not archive them and sell them, they would be lost. And also we enjoy speaking with new collectors. People want what they remember from growing up or want what they couldn't afford growing up and they want to be around it. I can tell you that I have customers that come in and just spend hours going through the stuff and thank me for giving them the opportunity to, to wander through the memories that, that are in here. Over the last several years there has been a dramatic increase in the amount of people involved in collecting. This renewed interest in nostalgia helps explain some of the high prices paid for some more hard-to-find artifacts. There are lots of reasons why people from all walks of life are willing to pay big money for just the right piece of history. Probably the most common thing I hear people say when they come through is, oh my god, I used to have that, or oh my god, do you remember that? And they can revisit those nice memories or early memories. It's like a trip through the past for them. And, no, and everybody likes that. Everybody wants to be delighted or excited, you know, about something that, that leave, left a good memory in their minds. They want something that inspires them and, and brings back good memories or maybe just creates new memories. Visually, it's stimulating. Um, it's a feel-good experience and they actually make being in this business worthwhile. Collecting all kinds of stuff has been enjoyed for a long time. And now, people everywhere are discovering that whatever your interest, with enough time and with enough persistence, you can probably find what it is you're looking for. And collectors everywhere will tell you, searching is only half the fun. That's it for this edition of Cablevision's Neighborhood Journal. If you have any comments or story ideas for future shows, you can email us at clp3 at cablevision.com. And check the local listing on this channel and watch I.O. Video On Demand for even more episodes. I'm Nancy DePasquale. See you next time.